it's time for some tender loving care. Um, the movie with uh, John Hurt. Well, actually, it's it's not not a, really a movie. It's 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 also a game. Also with John Hurt. Actually, it's not a game either. It's it's something in between, and it, it's really interesting. And uh, yeah, I want to talk about it a little, a little review again. A lot of uh, people who um, bought uh, the movie version were disappointed because it's not really much of a movie. And, and then a lot of people uh, who bought the game were disappointed because it's really not much of a game. It's it's something in between a movie and a game, but but not not either. It's if you think in between movie and game, you think you think uh, I don't know. You think interactive movie, uh, uh, or you you think um, interactive fiction, or you think uh, visual novel, or um, full motion video. You you think something like that, but it's not like that either. It's not. It's not really like anything uh, I've ever seen before. It's it doesn't fall into any genre genre, genre thingy that was there before. So um, it's it's something something different, really. So something new, something of its own. So when um, commercially this was not a success at all because uh yeah people were disappointed because they when they bought the, the movie they were expecting uh, you know your typical hollywood movie and they didn't get it and when they were buying the game they were expecting you know some kind of game like the games gamers usually play and they were not getting that either so um <clears throat> people were disappointed and and uh, uh that's the reason why some people gave this uh, uh bad ratings uh but i think this is unfair uh, uh, I, yeah it's uh you, you can you you shouldn't judge it as a movie or uh, as a game because it's not really a, either of that uh it's um yeah well it's kind of um it's it's similar maybe to um, uh, to a visual novel in the sense that you do interact uh, uh, with uh, uh, the plot uh, and that's and that's really uh, uh, all there is to it in, in a sense of gameplay your, your gameplay really is limited um, uh, to um, Interacting with the actual plot, I I, 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 I like that very much. It's uh, in that sense, it's actually similar to a visual novel. Um, okay, in in a game, you do walk. In a game in a, in a game version, <laughs> in the PC version, you do walk uh, around the house and stuff and collect clues. But it's not like um, if 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 you say that you think of an adventure game, but it's not really like an adventure game. It, it really doesn't have much gameplay it's uh, as i said the gameplay really is limited uh, to directly influencing the story sometimes you would walk into uh, a room and you you'd find clues and and uh, uh, as to what happened uh, in in that sense it's maybe a little like a, i don't know like a detective story it's not that either so <laughs> uh, and and depending on what clues you find it can influence your it influence the story uh but that's not the main way the story is influenced also sometimes you walk into a room and a, a character is in that room and he will directly interact with you that's something you don't have at all of course in the movie um and, uh, in the movie version um the movie there is there are two movie versions of this uh two dvd versions one retains a little bit of the interactivity and the other does not contain any interactivity at all and is really just a movie uh and that is the one you probably shouldn't get 
<laughs> so because that version doesn't retain any of that at all and it, it also cuts out most of the scenes with John Hurt so uh, d don't get that version um, yeah because I, I, I was really surprised and I find that interesting sometimes you walk into a room and the, and the character will directly interact with you and it's obvious that you're also a character uh, in the uh, movie game whatever um, but I haven't quite figured out what character you actually are um, I'm still doing that. I haven't uh, finished it. I have finished watching the movie, but the, as I said, the movie isn't isn't the same as the um, as the uh, PC version, and, and it's it's quite old. I think it came out in in 1997, but uh, you know they 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 since then they stopped uh, doing things like that. Um, but uh, it's really it's really an interesting thing. And uh, especially, uh, oh, I, I haven't, I haven't told uh, uh, you about the uh, main way in which you interact with the story. Um, it's uh, it's by um, the main way in which you interact in the story is actually quite interesting because. <laughs> it's by taking psychological <laughs> tests and, and and this is quite interesting and, and John Hurt is giving uh, the tests uh, and, and those are um, um, from what I'm being told uh, those are very similar uh, to actual psychological tests I, I've never done any of those so I wouldn't know but um, uh, yeah uh, the people who uh, actually have experience in this. They tell me this is actually very similar to actual psychological test, tests and uh, uh, kind of depending on your psychological profile and on your psychological reaction to each um, uh, 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 to each movie scene or uh, to how the story to, after after each act, after each chapter you take this psychological test and uh, to, to find out how you reacted to what you just saw, and and and, and also a little about yourself, uh, and it's really very interesting. And depending on your psychological reactions, uh, the story changes. So, for example, it says here, eighteen, and it says that same thing on the DVD. It says eighteen. Of course, on the DVD you can't change it. Uh, you have sex scenes, for example, on the DVD. Um, and of course, you also have the same sex scenes in here. The difference is, uh, I I wouldn't necessarily give it the same 18 label on the PC version because whether or not you actually see those sex scenes uh, depends again on your psychological profile. So uh, kind of uh, the game, whatever it is, finds out if you can actually handle those scenes and if you want to see those scenes and, and it finds that out through your psychological profile and then it shows you those scenes or if or it does not show you those scenes if you if it if it finds out that you don't actually want to see those scenes or can't handle those scenes it doesn't show you those scenes so it's actually quite interesting and as to the uh, sex scenes there um well uh i i saw them because i because i i saw the dvd and then naturally in there so uh, I think they're still in, they're necessary for the plot development. So yeah, well, but then again, it's a different thing in in the in the game version uh, where you have different paths, and depending on the path, uh, they're actually not necessary. Uh, yeah, but it, it gets kind kind of complicated if I get into it too much, uh, and I don't want to reveal too much about the story itself either. I haven't actually, I haven't said anything about the story so far. Uh, I, I, actually, I don't want to say anything about the story because it would give away spoilers. Also, be sure not to read uh, even the um, description. Don't read the description on the back of the box because, uh, well, not, not on the back of a... No, no, no. Read the description on the back of the uh, game version, but do not read the description on the back of the DVD version because that gives away spoilers. Uh, so I don't want to talk about the plot because anything I would say about the plot would probably either be totally misleading or, or give away spoilers. So um, the less you know about the plot, the, the better it is. 
Uh, well, but it, it's a really interesting plot. It it has a lot of uh, twists and turns, and it's it's really psychological. Yeah, of course, it's a psychological movie. Yeah, <laughs> of psych. Uh, uh, um, maybe it's maybe you could call it psychological horror, but then again, because um, the outcome changes depending on your. Um, choices and psychological profile <laughs> um it it's not really it it can be a horror movie or it cannot be it depends on on your choices actually so <laughs> it's really difficult to talk about the plot because um the plot changes uh, and I, I find it really intriguing and interesting. And also what's interesting is um, uh, uh, on, on top of influencing the story, uh, the, those psychological tests you take in the game, uh, they, it also gives you that, then it also gives you a psychological profile. So you know a little about yourself. Of course, it's not like, you know, uh, going to a real uh, psychologist or anything. Uh, but still, it's interesting. You know, it gives you some points. And as for me, uh, there were some interesting points uh, that I found out about me that uh, uh, that are actually correct. You know, so it's really interesting. <laughs> um, yeah. So if you can uh, still uh, grab the um, old uh, PC version somewhere, um go get it it's 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 really worth it uh try to stay away from the um dvd version that is not interactive because then it's just a movie and uh as a movie it's it's of course it doesn't it's not it's not meant to be a movie so yeah Was that? What? It must have been Jody. No, it was nothing. I heard her crying. I know I did. Allison. Good night, darling. Sleep well. Daddy loves you.
breakfast time. Did you get Jody's breakfast? Oatmeal and raisins, like always. She loves her oatmeal. Yeah, she certainly does. I see you're starting a new project. What's it going to be this time? It's a sweater for Jody. Thought so. It's her favorite color. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Allison, do you remember the nurse we discussed? The nurse for Jody? Yeah. Michael, I told you, I can take care of Jody myself. I know, I know, but Dr. Turner thinks it would be best if we just... Michael, please. He thinks it would be best for Jody. And that's what we both want, isn't it? What's best for Jody? Allison? Isn't it? Yes. Good. The nurse is coming today. Today? Yes, her name is Mrs. Randolph. Is she going to live here with us? For a while, till things get a little better. Jody's not going to like her. I think she'll be very helpful. And then maybe I can get back to work. And leave us here alone with her? Let's just give it a chance, OK? Let's see what happens. Allison. Okay. Okay.